The Fighting Irish of Notre Dame are almost synonymous with football power. One of their trademarks is tough, aggressive, heads-up line play. Head coach in Notre Dame since 1958 is Joe Kuharik, himself a tough, aggressive guard. First at Notre Dame, then with the professional Chicago Cardinals. Since 1938, Kuharik has taught football. In 1955, as head man of the Washington Redskins, he was named Pro Coach of the Year. No coach teaching football today knows more about good interior line play. Here is Coach Joe Kuharik. The term interior lineman usually refers to the guards and tackles since the center has a specialized assignment. We are going to use a guard, number 60, and a tackle, number 70, to demonstrate. Good execution begins with a well-balanced stance from which every type of block can be executed. It should be a comfortable stance, feet a natural distance apart, head up, shoulders squared. The lineman must be able to charge forward or to either side with equal ability, speed, and power, and never indicate which movement you are apt to make. The most important block in football is the shoulder block. Offense's success depends on it. Use of a right shoulder should coincide with a right foot step. Shoulder contact is simultaneous with leg drive. One arm is up in a flex position. The other hangs loosely. In wedge blocking, all linemen use shoulder blocks, charging simultaneously. We have our guard and tackle in game uniform so you can recognize and view them easily. Shoulder contact is made slightly above the thigh and moves up into the chest area as contact continues. The offensive lineman maintains shoulder to shoulder contact as long as possible. Let's see how the wedge works in an actual game situation. This one against Georgia Tech. The wedge is most effective when a defensive line is playing a waiting game. Our line uses shoulder blocks to wedge the defenders upfield and the runner selects his hole as it opens up. In a Notre Dame Navy game, our left tackle uses a quick reverse shoulder block to help open a hole. Good blocking technique pays off in good games. This sort of teamwork makes football the great game it is. Effective technique pays off in our game against Georgia Tech. The left guard and left tackle cross block to open a hole for the runner, who makes a good long game. A runner can usually go only as far as effective blocking takes him, and this must be well past the line of scrimmage into the secondary if you intend to win. relatively important wrinkle insofar as blocking techniques are concerned is the pattern of pass protection. Although this is basically straight shoulder blocking, the technique is somewhat different. Instead of aggressively blocking your opponent back or to the side, the blocking lineman reacts to the defensive charge. Football is basically a team game. The success of any individual is dependent on each and every teammate. And unless there is constant effort on the part of every man, team success is difficult to achieve. As an interior lineman, your basic assignment is strong, sturdy, effective blocking. When you execute your techniques well, the results can be thrilling, spectacular, and successful.